gosh, you guys, I have been meaning to get to this haul video for a long time now. In fact, in my last video, I said, oh, I'll have a haul video up within a couple days. Apparently, I lied. Um, I've been so busy. My life is so hectic, but in a good way, not complaining at all. It's like all good. <sighs> but anyway, getting some alone time to do a video is quite <laughs> a difficult thing to do. So what I did is lock my bedroom door. All my kids and grandkids are out there. My husband, they're all watching Disney movies or something. So you might hear them in the background. You might hear my grandson crying in the background. He's three months old and just got his shots today. So he's a little grouchy guy. Anyway, yeah, I'm locked in my room with a drink. <laughs> um, let me just get to this haul really quick because it's kind of a big haul. Not that I like went on some sort of crazy shopping spree or anything. It's just things that have been kind of like accumulated over a period of time that I really have been wanting to show and some of it's just kind of weird and random. Um, but I'm kind of weird and random so Anyway, <clears throat> the first thing I want to show you is a set, and I got this at a yard sale for $2. Isn't this cute? I love these. I haven't used them yet. I just kind of had to dust them off. Okay, and then not too long ago, we went to Ikea, and I got a few things. So let me show you. This seems really weird, but um, I got this <laughs> from Ikea. Because, like, my husband and I like to have water by the bed. But here in Mexico, it, it gets really dusty. I mean, like, dusting is a daily task. So, I don't want to just have a cup sitting next to the bed with no cover on it. Like, who knows if dust is going to get in. So, this is awesome. Right when I saw that, I'm like, oh, i got to have it. And then, with um, my grandkids here... They sell these, they sell plates and utensils too, but I already have a bunch of those. I have a bunch of cups, but we love these cups. These little cups and bowls, I think it's like $1.99 for each pack, which really is a good deal. And then, um, I don't have a matching set, <laughs> a complete matching set of measuring spoons anymore. I don't know along the way they've lost or who knows um, but yeah they have these cute little measuring spoons so I got those and this is so weird I got some coasters you guys I don't know I'm a coaster kind of person and one of my favorite things to get are these little sets of candles and this is peppermint but there are other One smells like peppermint, the other one's, one smells like chocolate, and one smells like cotton candy. It's probably not that, but <laughs> that's what my nose says. And these containers, hold on, once you use these, you can like boil hot water and stick them in the water, and then it'll just take like the candle wax out, but look how cute these little containers are. You can hold your jewelry, or... You know put more candles in it or whatever so I really love those little sets they always have different colors and flavors and then I've never seen these at Ikea I had to get them because <laughs> I have grandkids here these are oh gosh shit my nails are so bad I'm trying to grow them out a bunch of them broke I had to start all over so I chopped them all off and then like I painted them the other day but I was doing dishes and laundry and just, oh my, and yeah, they're, it's, it's hideous. Please excuse my nails. Anyway, look at these cute little band-aids. Let's focus. Look at those cute little bugs and the band-aids, all kinds of sizes. There are, um, 16 of one, 14 of one, and 10 of one. So I think this was like, 79 cents or something like that. 
so good deal <clears throat> oh my gosh and I can never have too many of these tea light candles I can't remember how much they are at Ikea but they're a really good deal in fact I got two <laughs> I go through them really fast. Sometimes I don't want to use like a whole, you know, candle. So I'll just need to do a little tiny something something and use a little tea light. Or I have my little like lantern thingies. I'm rambling. Okay, and then not too long ago, I placed an order with Amazon because I had some credit. And I uh, got a couple books that I've wanted for a long time. One is The Kitchen Witch. And I've kind of thumbed through it, and some of the recipes in here are awesome. Ooh. Yeah, so I can't wait to, like, crack this open and really try some of these recipes. And this I've really wanted for, like, a long time. The Incense, Oils, and Brews book. I'm sure a lot of you have that book, and I didn't, so I have it now. And I'm super excited to try some of these things in here. Okay, and then I opened these already, so you're going to see by the packaging that I opened them already. I got colored pencils. I'm going to show you why. Um, I have colored pencils somewhere. I think they're in storage. I don't know, but I needed some colored pencils like ASAP because I ordered a couple adult coloring books. One is the Spellbinding Images. That. and then these are like all the images inside I haven't started coloring in here yet but I did start in my other book this is um, another adult coloring book so really like beautiful beautiful images I'll try to show you I'll try to kind of flip through a little bit really nice stuff look at the detail I love this book. I did start a page in here. Which I think that is. Oops. Oh, there's the one I started. I love elephants. They're so cute. So, yeah, I highly recommend this one. And then, to add to my little collection, I got the Mystical Cat's Tarot. Right there. And I've already opened it and kind of played with it a little bit, but uh, I'm thinking, thinking of maybe doing a separate video, just kind of thumbing through um, the cards. They're beautiful. Really, really beautiful. Okay, and then I ordered a bunch of little, um, like, charms. So I'm going to show you. I have them all laid out down here, so I'm going to flip the camera around really quick and try to give you a good look. Hold on one second. So these are all the little charms that came in the order. Just love them. Look at this little cauldron. Isn't that cute? Oopsie. Yeah. Look at my hideous nails. Oh my gosh. I'm so embarrassed. Aren't those cute? So I have a lot of things I'm going to be using those for. I think it'd be really cute to make a little charm bracelet. But I have my spell kits and stuff. And I plan on incorporating these in a lot of uh, stuff that I do. Okay, so that's it from Amazon. And now I have a couple things, just some like little random things from three different places. One, I got these at Home Depot and um, it has like the striker on the bottom. These are really long matches. Um, I love these because if you have like uh, you know, the seven day candles, I, depending on how long I'm going to be away from home, depends on if I leave it on or not. So sometimes I do have to turn those out and, um, then like if it's, oh, <laughs> fuck it. But yeah, uh, you know, like when the candle gets like down to the bottom and how do you light it? I used to just get an incense, light an incense and hurry and stick it down there in, in the candle and light it. But, um. Since I found these, I don't have to. <laughs> and then, in um, a store in Tijuana, I got more matches because I think these are really cute for like 
little travel altars or whatever. And it's, I think, about a couple dollars for all of these. There are 10 boxes. And it let's see, has a picture on the back. Picture on the front. And it has a little, like, tab thingy right there. But look at these matches. They're just cute. So, yeah. Oops. I dropped them everywhere, but I will pick those up in a little bit. And I went to a smoke shop. Picked up some of my favorite incense. I got a couple boxes of these. Oh, smells so good. And then my favorite, Nachamba. I did get a box like this in this size, but I already used it all. So I have this big box. Oh, my favorite, my favorite. Okay. So finally, the last place I ordered from was The Dipper. And I'm so excited to show you guys. I did break into a couple of those packages because I just couldn't wait. Anyway, one thing about The Dipper, um, let me backtrack. I've, I've had incense from the dipper, but only because I've gotten them like in love mail or a swap or something. And so I've like been dying to order from the dipper. Finally, I was able to, and I kind of messed up something really bad in the order. It was so my fault, but, um, their customer service is like out of this world. I can't even say enough good things. Becky at the Dipper helped fix my issue, and I'm just going to say she went way above and beyond what I ever expected in customer service. So, for the high quality incense and the amazing customer service, I highly, highly recommend ordering from the Dipper. So let me show you what I got. Okay, apparently they always send you samples. So the samples that I got, I got hemp, and ooh, can't wait to burn this, and then butt naked, which I already know what that scent smells like, it's so good, I've made bath bombs uh, in butt naked scent, <laughs> so good, <clears throat> and then uh, for the order, I got a small pack of, I'm going to go through these kind of fast because there are a lot. Got a small pack of the patchouli flower. Oh, yummy. And a pack of the romantic nights. I don't know how this happened, but I guess I ordered three packs of witch doctor. Mm-hmm. I was asking people if I order from the dipper what do you recommend and a lot of people recommended this so maybe per person I'm like okay click click I don't know I don't know what happened but unless I got a freebie because I don't remember ordering three and then I got some dragon's blood which smells amazing oh, man. and this I have opened already and burned I just couldn't wait. It's the warm apple crisp, and it smells so cozy. I love it. Okay, and then I got big packs of my favorites. Okay, so one of the big packs I ordered was the Nichamba, um, which smells really, really good, but it smells nothing like that. That's okay, I'm not going to compare because it's just, I don't know how to explain it. It's really good. And then um, another big pack I got. This, oh, I love it. The cherry vanilla. I'm not big on cherry smell, but I really, really love this. I love, love, I love how it burns. It's amazing. And then I had to get Sex on the Beach. And look, I opened it, of course. Oh, smells so good. It smells so good. I can eat it. Yeah, this, I, I just, like, I have no words to describe how good these incense are. Can you hear, can you hear my grandson? 
Oh, poor little guy. I'm going to have to go snuggle him a lot. Okay. My all-time favorite from the dipper, cedar and saffron. Oh my gosh, I just love it. I love the smell of cedar. Cedar reminds me of my dad, and I miss him. He's He passed away in 2008. Um, but he lived in Washington and um, kind of lived off the land, and some of what he did included cedar. So a lot of times he would come home smelling like cedar. I love it. Okay, moving on before I start shedding tears. Wait, wait, wait. Let me deal with my emotions, okay? Okay, okay. Wait, there's another emotion. Good. I'm good. <laughs> okay, now I got my favorites in the big sticks. So these are all repeats, but they're just big because I like a big. <laughs> so I got the Nachamba in the big sticks. And I got the cherry vanilla. Look how huge these are. They're huge. They last forever. And sex on the beach. And I like rip that open like a coyote. I'm like, Arr. but yeah. <laughs> And of course, the cedar and saffron. Okay, and finally, the last thing that I got from the dipper, because I do not have a way to burn my big giant incense. I mean, I guess I could like figure something out, but it's my excuse. I couldn't burn the big six, so I needed to order this. So I got this tombstone, tombstone style incense burner. Look how beautiful. Look at the detail on that. It's not beautiful. So you stick the incense in here and it catches the ash right here, but it opens and get in there. Well, let's just pull the bag back down. Anyway, it's a storage for your big sticks. Yeah. So anyway, that was my haul. Sorry, it's a little wishy-washy or whatever. I don't know. My brain is just that way. Um, yeah, I do jazz fingers when I don't know what the fuck I'm talking about. Or if I'm looking for something and I can't find it. I'm like, where is it? Where is it? Or if I'm like stressing out, I'm like, oh my God, oh my God. I don't know. Jazz fingers. Hello. Just don't ask. So yeah, thank you for sitting through this boring haul. Um, I hope you enjoyed it actually. And let me know if you have any of these items. Like, uh, have you tried the adult coloring books? Do you have that tarot deck? Let me know how you, uh, you know, how you feel working with it and everything. So far to me, it feels really good. And um, have you ordered from the dipper before? Have you tried any of these? Is there anything else that I'm missing? So yeah, I hope you guys have a great week and um, have a drink. <laughs> Bye.